So I wanted to ask you about the John Ash case or whatever was being called the John Ash case. What do you what, what do you conclude from from what's come out so far in terms of how it kind of penetrated the UN and what time, type of reforms do you think are needed? Thank you. About this former PGA John Ash's case, uh, I was really shocked, and I have um, uh, established a small um, a task force led by my chief of staff, uh, Susanna Malcora. Thank you very much. Thank you. John Ash and Thank, thank, you. thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you. These are. Oh, yeah. Masood, sorry. Stefan. Uh, can, you, can you please uh, t tell us uh, about uh, the blogger, Mr. Matthew Lee, who has been uh, very active on the internet, seeing all kinds of uh, reports, whether false or not. As to where, what is his status now? Waits. We wait him uh, to return so he can vacate uh, his office. Thank you. I thought you might have it. Yesterday I'd asked Stefan, and he'd said it was not an unfair question, whether the Secretary General approved the service of Jane Hall Lute oh, on yes. Union Pacific's board. Yeah, yes, we've checked. Uh, and uh, the answer is yes, she did seek approval and did receive it. And I, what I wanted to ask, I have a second question, which is that the special, is Mr. Han Seong Su still the special advisor on water and risk uh, reduction? Uh, I believe he was appointed that some time ago. I, whether he still has that portfolio or not, I'd need, I would need to check. Because what I want to know is that he's also on the board of directors of a South Korean firm, Doosan Infracore, which is listed in the UN procurement database as doing business with the UN. So I wanted to know if, if maybe you can get, like, actually send me the answer. Whether, in fact, if these two services are concurrent, whether it's been approved by the Secretary General, and whether, whether there's some special kind of safeguards that he recuse himself from business involving the UN, or whether it's possible to be a UN special advisor on the board of a company that does business with the UN. Well, first, first and foremost, I'll need to check what, what his status is, whether he's an advisor or not. Okay. Have a good afternoon. Uh, yesterday I asked about Han Sung Su and, the, and whether he's the special advisor. Yes, uh, yes, he remains special advisor. Uh, I've put in a request to the ethics office to see whether uh, he's made any um, uh, notifications of different business dealings. I, I believe he may have done some, but I'm, I'm trying to get it from the ethics office. Alas, at this time of summer, there's some offices that uh, will be harder to get replies back from. But so would, I just, I'll I, let you know I, once I have it. Sure. No, I, have to, I, just want, I guess I want to understand. There's a rule that seems to say that a person needs approval from the secretary general for outside was, does that apply here, or is it just a matter of, of saying that you're doing it? Uh, well, first I need to check uh, again whether, whether the ethics office has had any notifications of any other activities. 